Life was so simple when I was just working in the garage with my grandpa. He used to say, cherish every moment, boy, and do as much good as you can. You never know. Tomorrow morning, you just may see God. And he was right. My grandpa knew I was special. And he always used to say, there's others out there that know about us and to watch out for the ones who would take our power and use it for evil. After Grandpa died, I was just another mouth to feed at Grandma's house. Mr. Yates in the Theta program said I was just what they were looking for, a nonlinear programmer, whatever that means. In the Theta program, I learned to code my visions into the computer. And after a while, as I began to code, I fell into a trance. And the code began to write itself. Everything started off so innocent. I would have never thought it would arrive here. This whole time I hadn't been creating anything. They were using me as a vessel to gain access to etheric data. But before I could destroy my creation, the corporation had me thrown in prison to grow old and die with my secrets. They took my computers, but I still had one left. With my simulation glasses, I was able to experiment in 3D reality from inside of my cell. When I would return from my trance, I would chronicle my findings in a series of books that would come to be known as the Quantum Ledgers. And when society broke down after the destruction of the cities, so did the prisons. Finding myself now on the fringes of our civilization, where the ones who have no name call their dwelling. It was there I found refuge in the Brotherhood. Now there's a bigger problem to solve, which is what to do about our fallen world.